a pretty quick example here of how to create a feedback form and embed it in your Power BI app so that it looks something like this. I want to just be able to go into my Power BI app. Here we are, got a couple of reports in here, got a feedback form as well. Click on that. And then somebody could say, right, I want to give some feedback on this one. It's pretty useful and give some more feedback. Okay, so I'll show you how. Let's go. All right, I've put an Excel file in a, a Teams folder or a SharePoint site, somewhere that people can access. Okay, so here it is. And if I open that up, I get this. I'm just going to insert a form. And I've already done one, so you go New Form, and it opens up, and it looks like this. And you can add questions, multiple choices, put a title in, text, ratings, dates, all sorts of cool stuff, okay? You've probably seen one of these before. And when you've built your form, you say Collect Responses, Anyone can respond or only people in my organization. I guess if it's an internal report, do that. Um, all good. So then you can just copy this link. And then where do you put it? Well, if you go into Power BI and you go to your workspace and you create an app, so you can go create app, you put a description in here, all the other little bits and pieces you do. Then you can go to content. And here, this is where you add it. So you click on the drop down and you add a link. Okay, add a link, call it feedback form. Put two in there because I've already got one here. Paste the link. Where do you want to open it? You can even open it internally. So current tab, new tab. I like the content area, pretty cool. Uh, you can add it to a different section if there was a different section. And then we click add. And then there's your feedback form and I'll just drag it down the bottom, ready to share in the app. And you click Update App or Create App if this is the first time you're doing it. Within the audiences as well, you can share to different audiences over here. But that's it. There's the feedback form. You know, and then it shows up inside the app. So here we go. I just go to my apps, open up my app here. And here's my feedback form ready to gather my feedback. So where does the feedback go? Well, let's say I'm feedback on Q&A forms. It's that useful. Uh, more pie charts. Okay, submit. And the nice thing about this is that when I go back to my Excel file, okay, takes a few seconds sometimes, but there we go. Q&A form. How useful is it? More feedback. And it's just all maintained in here. You can even use this, you know, Power Query could connect to this pull it in, load it into the report itself if you wanted to show the feedback, or just use it for analysis. There you go. Hope you find it useful. Pretty quick one today. Catch you in the next video.